Yeah, I found it. I was right. Let's be... We need to go into some grass. Over here, maybe? Like, I was right that this was it. I just thought maybe it was be after. Go over to the car wreck. Behind? Uh, huh. See the hand holding the gun up. Says you're supposed to go into some grass nearby. I had to actually look up a guide for this, and it's not working still. Look at her. Chloe can even chill out playing with a gun. Back here? I feel like I'm being stupid. so quiet and primordial out here. I always feel like the forest is whispering to me. Like Arcadia Bay is trying to tell me something. I just have to figure out the message. Like, this seemed like the best spot. Like, you see the gun being held up. But it's like, it's too far away. Was this camera supposed to be a hint? It's supposed to be here? I'm just... Screw you. You know what? Screw you. Really? That's it? Ugh. Okay. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? Oh, boo-hoo, Max is afraid. I know you can handle this, and I'm here to guide you. Make me proud, sister. <sighs> hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute that you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, man. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough? What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend, and it's none of your goddamn business. 
You're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. Give it to me right now, asshole. You better step back before you regret it, girl. I mean it. You want me to cut you, bitch? Please. Please step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Ah, I just enjoyed a snack while they're waiting on this. That is hilarious. Oh, man. I'll remember you, kid. I'll remember you almost shot me. And you'll wish I had no memory because I never forget. You have until Friday to pay me. Don't ever pull crap like this again. It'll be the last time you do. Try bullets next time, brainiacs. Sorry. You are awesome. Thanks for standing up for me. <sighs> Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Jesus, I almost shot this guy. And now he'll be more dangerous to Chloe and me. Chloe's waiting to go for a walk. We both... Wow, sir. Why did Frank have Rachel's bracelet? We need to talk about this later, but I better follow Chloe now. Left mouse button. I still can't believe you pulled a gun on Frank. That was epic. It felt awful. I'm glad there was no bullets in there. You can just rewind time in your hand and stick that barrel right up Frank's ass. You have the power! You're gross. Don't fall. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Uh. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could stay forever. What the hell is with the birds? Jeez. Can we build another pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? I'm still freaked out about what happened. That was awful, Chloe. I'm sorry. But Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, did you see what just happened? I almost shot him. I know I could rewind, but Chloe, this is not playtime. No more guns. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers, he's just a dealer, where I get my weed. The one in your joint, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Is this your bad boy phase? No, it's my trying to scrounge some quick cash so Rachel and I could get the hell out of here phase. Frank had quick cash, that's all. That's it? No, I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy. Without him eyeballing us, okay? Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens. And it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at night. Look at the bead poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. 
You just have to stop being afraid. Find a tool to cut those wires. Shit. 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 Not now is not Please, the time to be getting stuck on things. Shit, I can't budget at all. Am I supposed to get in? Definitely use this bad boy. Get me out of here! Rewind. Rewind faster, please. Thank you. Ah, score! can pull a total MacGyver. Huh. Whoa. Please, get me out of here! Oh, uh, that's not the option I want to take. Thank you. Saving friend, one thing. Sending... Max! Again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Damn. That was close. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Snow equals the ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? <laughs> Five years ago, asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. 
How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. So are you going to that Vortex Club party? Like I would Justin miss it. always yeah, looks dumb. If I was normal, I'd be super excited about going to a major shindig. Zach. Sup, Max? It's weird to not see you without your camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sext in Victoria. It's over. Just another Blackwell mini drama. You mean stupid shit. Man, I just don't get Victoria. What does she want? Probably for all of us to talk about her. Like now. Then let's not. You're pretty smart, Max. See you at the game Friday. That snow was so insane. Seriously. Hello, yeah, climate change. Samuel. There's Banner, there's the principal, there's David. Trevor. Trevor surveys his domain. Uh, speak. Sir? Oh. Hello, Max. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. No. Never mind. Glad to see you weren't about to accuse another student of something or other. Now, if you'll excuse me. Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? No, it belonged to a friend of mine. Are you gonna bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you, but it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. I suppose that's a fair enough attitude to have. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. I'm not anti-soiree. You seem anti-fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. And rewind. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. As you can see, I would need your advice on what to wear. Thanks, Max. 
I didn't think you noticed high fashion. Tell you what, I'll put you down on the guest list, and before the party, I can give you some tips. Cool. Thanks, Courtney. I'll send you the party info later. Back to the list. A little too easy. Let's see what else we got around here. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. Luke is always using the phone as a shield to avoid people. I saw Victoria and her friends shopping for the party. That reminds me, I have to score some weed from Nathan. I really hope this jackass will use protection next time. Juliet is laying the smack down on Zachary. Oh, that's not... like, huh? What's this open door here? Huh. Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. Making your daily rounds? Think, big brain, think. How is your drone? Miss Grant busted me flying it over the parking lot. She's all jacked up about surveillance bullshit. Like I was spying on Warren's new car. You already planted a GPS on him? This can't be him? that hard. I borrowed the one he has on you. Well, there's more. I hate to hit here. and run, but... Don't let me get in your way. So long. Bring me the brain, Igor. Speak. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Uh. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go potassium. Potassium it shall be. If this works, you get a free hug. Weird science. Hey, Warren. Maxwell so asking me for help? I have that either. I actually think you should use a lot of potassium. I mean, a shitload. See? Look at that smile. You're going to become a scientist yet. Let's do this thing. She blinded me with science. Yeah, I saw this. Hi, Miss Grant. Funny, I was just thinking about you, Max. I saw Thanks this. Thanks again for taking a stand against camera surveillance here. Every signature counts. Miss Grant, can I ask you a possibly dumb science question? You know my stock teacher answer. There are no dumb questions. Ask away. Would you add potassium or sodium to a chemical mix for this week's experiment? Neither. Unless you want a face full of powder. I would add chlorine. Damn it, teacher. You're supposed to <coughs> be more distracting. I'm just thinking about all the autumn photos I want to take. Oh, this is my favorite time of year. I do love the season change. This whole campus is a visual delight. I know Mr. Jefferson loves to shoot around here. You must like photography. I do, but I'm certainly no artist. I'm all about the science. You can't debate numbers. I have to say, it's not quite autumn enough yet. What about that snow yesterday? What's your scientific explanation? Our climate is moving beyond explanation. Of course, some of the tribes here might see it different. How is your campaign going? You signed the petition, now it's your campaign too. Thanks for stepping up. 
More people would rather send a text than sign a petition. That's how they keep us all distracted. Nobody will notice cameras on every square foot. I know. I really hope you keep those cameras from taking over Blackwell. Max, with students like you, we sure will. I'm sorry, Miss Grant, but I have to get going. Go on, Max. We'll talk again. Real soon. I have to rewind through... Oh, God. Yeah, I have to rewind. about the experiment. Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. I need to know if you can help me with a potassium experiment. No can do, Max. I'm all about robotics, not chemistry. Give me a drone over a beaker. I'm helping Warren with his latest experiment. Oh, I guess he needed a neophyte assistant so he wouldn't be threatened. But you came to his rescue anyway. Not me. Warren doesn't need my help. The boy knows things. How is your drone? Miss Gr- You already planned it? I borrowed the one- I hate okay. to hit and run. Don't let me get in your- <sighs> Hey, Warren. Maxwell Silver? Asking me for? Have to add either of. Wrong, Warren. You need to add chlorine. Not potassium or sodium. Chlorine? I didn't think of that. Can't argue with a confident scientist. Let's try it. Eureka! She's got it. No, you got it. Don't be so modest, Dr. Caulfield. Oh, you guys really broke the bounds of science. <laughs> that was fun else. helping Warren. He's pretty cute when he's in full-on geek mode. Maybe this so is you your way of getting attention. I'm trying, but you have to understand my position. Why? You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Nobody. Yo, Maxwell Smart. Talk later, cool?